presents and not opening them. <laughs> so much for giving us such a beautiful day today and thank you that you've been holding off the rain. Thank you for bringing together Nate and Brittany and thank you that they're so special to each other and so special to us and thank you that we can spend this wonderful day with them celebrating. Please bless the rest of this day in your name. Amen. Love you. this guy. We love Brittany. We love them together and we're so glad that they found each other and that they're committed to each other. We're here to celebrate that today and we, we want good things for them today. We want good things for them tomorrow and just for the rest of their lives. We pray that that happens. Aww. Thanks, Ma. Love you. Dear God, I thank you for this wonderful day. Thank you so much for bringing Brittany into Nate's life and Nate also into Brittany's life and she has been such a great example of a Christ follower and she just rocks the world. <laughs> Thank you so much that she has been able to be open with each and every one of us and to be a good friend as well as a good sister and as well as a good future sister. I'm so thankful that she is going to be joining our family as well as Nate joining hers. You look so pretty. I know. <laughs> We're getting married. I know. So thankful that you've chosen to bring these two together and so we come before you with thanks and praise we thank you so much for the wonderful day and if we're not raining thank you lord you are good we uh praise you because you have made this day and because you have made an awesome amazing brother i'm so thankful for him lord let your blessings fall upon him put your favor upon him so that when he goes on this great adventure with Brittany, he'll go with you and they'll both grow together we love you so much and we thank you that you have blessed us to be able to be here to see this happen because these two people, oh Lord, they are great, they are wonderful and we thank you so much for me. Thank you, thank you, thank you.
Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today in the presence of God and of this company that Nate and Brittany may be united in holy matrimony. We are here to celebrate and share in this glorious event. Today, we're going to have an opportunity to, to witness them to make a vow. This is a vow that they will love each other all of their lives until death parts them. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I. Nate, do you take Brittany to be your lawful wedded wife? If so, answer, I do. I do. Nate, will you pledge your faithfulness to her? Will you love her in all honor, all duty, and service, in all faith and tenderness? Will you promise to live with her and cherish her according to the ordinance of God and the holy bond of matrimony? If so, answer, I will. I will. Brittany, do you take Nate to be your lawful wedded husband? If so, answer, I do. I do. Brittany, will you pledge your faithfulness to him? In all love and honor, in all submission and service, in all faith and tenderness, to live with him and cherish him according to the ordinance of God and the holy bond of matrimony? If so, answer, I will. I will. I, Nathan Daniel Porter. I, Nathan Daniel Porter. Promise you, Brittany Lynn Ostrink. Promise you, Brittany Lynn Ostrink. My deepest love. My deepest love. My fullest devotion. My fullest devotion. My tenderness and care. My tenderness and care. Loving what I know of you. Loving what I know of you. And trusting what I do not know yet. And trusting what I do not know yet. I will cherish our union. I will cherish our union. And love you more each day. And love you more each day. Than the day I did before. Than the day I did before. I will laugh with you. I will laugh with you. And cry with you. And cry with you. I promise to respect you. I promise to respect you. And trust you. And trust you. I promise to remain faithful. I promise to remain faithful. All the days of our lives. All the days of our lives. As your husband. As your husband. I will love you faithfully. I will love you faithfully. For rich or for poor. For rich or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I give you my hand. I give you my hand. My heart. My heart my love my love so that together so that together we may be one we may be one growing in the likeness of Christ growing in the likeness of Christ from this day forward from this day forward till death do us part till death do us part I Brittany Lynn Ostering I Brittany Lynn Ostering promise you Nathan Daniel Porter promise you Nathan Daniel Porter my deepest love my deepest love my fullest devotion my fullest devotion my tenderness and care my tenderness and care loving what i know of you loving what i know of you and trusting <laughs> what i do not know yet and trusting what i do not know yet i will cherish our union i will cherish our union and love you more each day and love you more each day than the day i did before than the day i did before i will laugh with you I will laugh with you and cry with you and cry with you. I promise to respect you. I promise to respect you and trust you and trust you. I promise to remain faithful. I promise to remain faithful all the days of our lives. All the days of our lives. As your wife. As your wife. I will love you faithfully. I will love you faithfully. For rich or for poor. For rich or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I give you my hand. I give you my hand. My heart. My heart. My love. My love. So that together. So that together. We may be one. We may be one. Growing in the likeness of Christ. Growing in the likeness of Christ. From this day forward. From this day forward. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. By the authority committed to me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I declare that Nate and Brittany are husband and wife. Nate, you may kiss your bride. It is with great pleasure that I present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Nate and Brittany Porter. Once upon a time, a little girl was born in a very, very bright room. And the father prayed to his heavenly father, Dear Lord, thank you for this beautiful baby girl and how healthy she is. And the father realized that one day this beautiful little girl would be a gorgeous woman. Late at night, the father would quietly sneak into her room, kiss her on the cheek, and kneel down and pray. Heavenly Father, bring my little girl a man who loves you first, loves my baby second, and trusts in you to love himself last. 
and make them both to love you and follow you always. One day, the beautiful young woman brought a young man home for her father to meet. And he was skinny, with a head full of curls. <laughs> he didn't say much, but he was a good eater. The father quietly thought to himself, Lord, is this little guy the one? But one day the father noticed the young man not only grew in stature, but also in his love for the Lord, his love for his father's daughter, and for others around him. And that's when the father realized that he finally had a son. I want to be honest with you, Nate. You always have inspired me even though you're my younger brother the way you go after a challenge you just float and you're suspended and then you zoom to the moon and like nothing can stop you and i've seen that with your relationship with Brittany. it's just such a beautiful relationship because you're always so calm and you don't let anything get in your way and it's very inspiring <laughs> And I'm so proud uh, to call you my brother, and I'm so proud to call you Brittany, my sister. She's wonderful every time she hangs out with me and with our family. She fits in like a glove, and she brings so much peace, but also so much joy into our family. You know that Brittany and I have not always gotten along. So now, as we've gotten older, things have changed. We now can share friends so much more, which I love, because she's got a lot of great friends. And I've gotten to know you guys so much more throughout this engagement process, and it's been fabulous. I just love it because through all of this, haven't just gained a brother-in-law, but I've gained a lot more friends, and so this has been fabulous. Um, and Nate, I just I want to welcome you in, into our family as well. We love you very much, and Brittany loves you too. So we're so happy that you are together, and I've really loved getting to know you over the last three and a half years. Congratulations to both of you. I hope you have a wonderful week in Mexico. And um, we'll have a wonderful next 70 years together, okay? Nate, you're, you're an amazing guy. You're, you're such an amazing, inspiring person. You're this man who does amazing things with his life. And I'm, I'm so excited to see what's next for you. Because you're, you're just such a great guy and we love you. I love you so much. And I'm so happy for you today. This has just been so fun to be a part of. Brittany, getting to know you over the last few years has been so great. You are so good for Nate, and it's so clear Nate is so good for you, and we're so excited about that. We've all loved getting to know you so much, and can't wait for what's next for both of you guys. We love you so much, and we're just so happy to be here to celebrate you guys today.